Hello everybody, and welcome. Today, we are going to be starting a brand new Minecraft series, and I am dubbing it UltaZoo. Basically, the goal of this mod pack is to make a zoo with both Zawa creatures and with fossils and archaeology dinosaurs, which will be really cool. So, I am doing this in survival. Oh, shoot. Oh, it doesn't have TNT, it just makes that sound. Oh, wow. First thing I start off and I already have like diamonds and stuff. How lucky am I to find an inventory pet first thing? That's actually really crazy. Anyway, um, I am joined by a bunch of friends in this mod pack, although they might be logging on and off periodically. I am not entirely sure. Also, do these give me goodies? I don't quite remember if birds get, uh, nests give me goodies or not. Ooh, there's a wizard's tower. Okay, let's head over there for starters. Um, so my goal, yeah, is to make a giant, um, a giant zoo with different things and such. Now, the main problem with this mod pack is that it has the ice and fire mod, which means that I am going to be battling dragons and other otherworldly creatures, and I am not entirely sure if I'm going to survive those battles or if my zoo will survive those battles. So we might have some devastation in between. Also, what is this? I can't pick it up for now. Also, what is a nymph? I don't like it. Um. Ooh. Well, that's a little hot. I mean, maybe we set up base here. I'm not sure. So there's a tree growing in here. Hello there, Earth Mage. I don't know what you're asking. Um, and I don't know how to get magic crystals, so I can't do anything yet. I am going to quickly, uh, name this, um, Wizards Hut, and we are going to save it just in case we have to come back here. So, time to go back down. And I do have an anvil pet, what does he do? Um, he, uh, slowly auto-repairs damage items in inventory, and summons and dismiss living anvil. Uh, his favorite food is an iron nugget, and I have a few of those, so I should be able to feed him. That's good. I don't want to have an inventory pet right away, and then have it die, because I don't know how to take care of it. Also, what is that up there? Is that a siren's rock? Wow. That is, a. Uh crazy. Also, I think that's an inventory pet thing. I might want to go up there and get a better look. So, let's see here. Real quick, we're going to go over here. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to start off with. I might try and get like a wood, definitely. Because I want to stay safe for the night. What? I can hear zombies. And I don't know where the sounds are coming from. That's actually quite scary, but... Oh, I hate that. I hate that. Where are these guys coming from? I hate the sounds I'm hearing right now. Holy crap! No! Bad! In fact, we're going the other way because I can already see a dig site. Holy crap! There's so many and they have guns! They have guns! I don't have any weapons to fight things with guns. There's a sea serpent. There's whales. This is already off to a scary start. It was amazing at first because I got diamonds and stuff. But, I mean, come on! Like, two zombies with guns. A sea serpent. Like, what is going on? I'm, I'm really confused right now. I'm just making my way over to this dig site. I really hope I don't get intercepted. Holy cow! There's a green anaconda. Okay, we shot a, We should uh, really stay clear of that. But we came across a dig site. So let's go around here. We can set up base here, probably. I don't know what that thing is. Um. Oh, shoot. That's Medusa's temple. Holy crap! What is that thing? Why are there so many? Holy crap. Oh, let me in. 
Let me in. Okay. Whew. 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 Holy cow. Right off the bat, and I'm already, um, I'm already shivering in my timbers right now. I don't even know what I'm doing. We're gonna break this real quick. I'm gonna set up camera. Right now. Um. Why do those guys make that sound? Okay, we gotta get some basic tools right now. So. We get a, uh, a sword too. These guys are loud as heck. Why are they so loud? And we'll also get an axe. Also, my mouse sensitivity is really low. Let me just change that real quick. Okay, that's better. Okay. I'm a little scared of those things, but hopefully if I mine these. Oh, I should probably get a stun pickaxe first. I'm not quite sure what that thing does. Also, there's literally a blue sea serpent that is getting insane right now. There's so many things in this ice and fire mod. I mean, and I don't know how to, um, stop it. Like, they are overwhelming me. What the heck? What is a verdant salamander? I don't want to go in there because there's a sea serpent in there, but... Also, I don't think I can mine any of this stuff. Oh, sweet, the rain stopped. But I don't think I can mine any of this stuff until I get iron, so we gotta go look for iron. And also, the sun seems to be setting, so we gotta come back here after we get some iron. Some coal might be useful, and maybe enough to make a furnace. That would be amazing. Make a furnace. What is that thing? I can hear noises, and I don't know what they are, and I am a little scared. There's the sea serpent, mouth wide open. I don't know what it's trying to do. Whoa. Whoa. There's so many different little sheep guys in here, and I have no clue what any of this does, including this. What is that? I don't know. I have no clue what that is. I have no clue what any of this is. I'm going to bed. Um, it's terrifying. The only problem is I can't sleep. Also, I don't think... Oh, I can make a piece of bread. Just one, but it should be enough. Wait, what? Oh, sweet. She's asleep. I sleep too. Okay. For some reason... Oh, there we go. So, I can't make a piece of bread. Why? I don't know. <laughs> Holy crap! Holy crap! I don't want to be here anymore. Oh, I don't want to be here anymore. Stop it. Stop it. I want to go back to my house. I want to go back to my house. How do I stop them? How do I stop them? They're so mean. I got myself into such a pickle. I should not have. Yeah, kill him. Yeah. Okay, cave spider. This is not what I want to be doing. No. Where did it go? No. Stop. Where did it go? Wait, I could just bring everything over here. Curious crystal. Oh, sweet. Yeah, kill him. Gonna eat my celery in peace. And my cabbage. And my cotton. I don't know why I can eat cotton, but I can. And my melons. I have melons. That's good. Yes, attack them, Aegis level 2. Attack them. Help me attack them, Aegis level 2. Help me. No! You meanie! Kill him! Kill him with fire! Jeez! What? What? Why is there a reaper? Ow! Oh! Holy crap. I gotta heal. 
No, please. I did nothing to you. I did nothing. Stop it. Stay away from me. Stay away. Stay away. Stay away. Holy crap. Holy crap. Can I please leave? I want to go home. I want to go home. Thank gosh. Ho, oh, I broke it. Holy cow. That was, that was scary. I can't believe I killed them all with just a wooden sword. That was insane. So I think I need at least um, an iron pickaxe, but I need to go scavenge for some food because I am hungry. The best thing I can get right now is I think um just some like bushes that Pam's Harvest Craft adds. There's also these little sheep guys. They're pretty silly. Now I see a bunch of fossils. Oh, this is good. Get stock up on my health. Some of this stuff. Get beets. Peas. And, uh, celery. Now let's get some coal. And the next thing I need is iron. Iron is gonna be awesome. So let me just real quick. Frick, what have I done? There. Okay. I apologize. I full screened my Minecraft, so it's not that bad anymore. Um... Those Yule are so loud. Okay. Or whatever they are. I think they're like Yule or something. So. I'm not sure where exactly to find iron. What is this? Rune stone. Oh. Um. Okay, we need a cave, and we need a cave fast. The only thing is, I don't know where the closest cave would be. Also, there's something called a Medusa that literally mm, turns you to stone if you go in there. And I don't know what to do if I would go in there. I don't know. There's some orcas out there. It'll be cool when I start getting my uh, zoo. I might actually situate it in a lake. Because I have noticed that most sea serpents spawn in oceans. So if I make a really big lake in the middle of the plains, then no sea serpents can get in. Therefore, I can have a lake um, habitat with no predators around it. I also have to make sure um, that, no, what is it, no dragons live around there, because if they do, and they see me, they're gonna kill me and all of my hard work, so, once I start building, I have to find a place where no dragons are around, or where I've killed all the dragons, and also where, uh, there's no sea serpents, and I can just make, like, a giant lake, so that way they don't go in there. But if you guys have any suggestions, be sure to let me know, because I would be willing to take any suggestions. I am not that educated on most of the mods in here. 
I have not played that much with anything other than dragons and ice and fire, and I'm not experienced with battling any mobs in ice and fire and survival. And I'm also not very um, experienced with those those creatures. I don't know what the mod they're in is called, but like the ones that are uh, look pretty interesting. Oh gosh, a zombie farmer. Oh, he stepped into daylight and he's burning up. I just evaded him. He's gonna chase after me, but he's gonna die. Which is honestly, I'm not concerned. Ooh, maybe he's one of those dark magic guys, cause he looked pretty um like them when he evaporated, or I don't know, died, I guess. He seemed a lot like them, so maybe that's what he is. Also, it's already getting late, and I have not found a single piece of iron. Maybe I should go strip mining, but I am not entirely sure. I think I'm going to head back to base for now. Um, what is this? Crystal flower. Can I turn it into crystals? Yes, I can. I could go back to that wizard's hut and get some stuff. Um. Okay, let's see here. Where did the hut go? Oh, it's down there. Oh, there's so many zombies coming out. I gotta get back. Whoa. It's a zombie. Hello there, Mr. Archaeologist. I just have to get back. Also, what was that? I don't know. Whew. You may not rest now. There are monsters nearby. Yeah, I can tell. Come out and fight me like a real man, buddy. Maybe he left. Oh, I can hear him. I can hear him, alright. I want to go to bed. go to bed. What is outside? What is outside? Holy crap, it's that. It's a reaper. Oh, maybe it can't get through wool. so much scary things. Yes, all the zombies are dying. So I have to set out early, but before I go, I'm going to quickly upgrade my pickaxe. Um, not my pickaxe, my sword. I'm also going to, I don't have enough uh, wood, or good enough wood. I need to go get some good wood. Good wood. Um, I want to make a chest. Because then I can store all my stuff. No. No, bro. 
Bro, I am not dying to a dragon. Don't tell me there's one on top of the mountain. I don't want to deal with a dragon on top of the mountain, bro. It's going to burn down my house. And then I'm going to die. I don't want to deal with a dragon. I hate dragons. Well, I like dragons. But not specifically when they're trying to kill me. It's not fun when they're trying to kill me. It's in fact very mean of them to try and kill me. Okay, there's one. Except it can't open, so what's the point of putting it there? Maybe if I just get rid of this, I can just put it in a corner. Not worry about it. Uh, yeah, sure that works. Okay, here we go. We're gonna put all my valuables and such in here. Holy crap! Oh no! No! Okay, luckily I put away my valuables. The bad thing. No, he's right there. Please don't see me, don't see me, don't see me, don't see me. Don't see me. Fly away! Is my stuff safe? My stuff. My stuff. Also, I don't want to stay near that thing. Oh, crap. How am I supposed to? I guess my best chance right now is just to escape. But he is after me. Please, no. I don't want to die this way. All of my valuables. Gone. Destroyed. And he's still stalking me. And there's nothing I can do. And this is the sad truth behind Ice and Fire. Everything that I owned is now gone. Well, I have to start from new. <laughs> Make a new base, get some new tools. That's just sad, honestly. This is why I have a love and hate relationship with Ice and Fire. I like the mobs and stuff, but it sucks sometimes. Now, I might remove the mod later. Not really because, you know, I don't like it. I do. It's just going to be so hard to make a zoo when stuff like that keeps happening to me. What is that? I don't want that thing. Get out of here. Get out of my skin. Stop it. Stop it. No. Bad. Bad. Why is it biting me? Why is it attacking me? And did it stop? Maybe it's like a keeper of trees? You know, maybe maybe it doesn't want me cutting down its trees? That would make sense. For sure. Oh gosh. All of my hard work. Everything destroyed. Um, there's a witch's hut, but I don't know if I wanna go in there, especially if the witch is in there. I'm going to see if it is, and if it is, I'm not going to bother, but if it's not, okay, it's over there. Okay, we're going to turn these into planks. Right now. We're just going to go for it. Um, okay, I'm going to take your crafting table, and I'm going to take your cauldron. Wait, I can't take your cauldron. <laughs> Oh, hi, please don't attack me. You're, uh... You're just sad. You're just a sad little boy. That actually kind of sucks. 
Um, so actually, I'm going to cut the recording here real quick. Maybe discuss some things. And I'll see you back in a little bit. Okay, everybody. After that slaughter, I am back. After some consolation, um, me and the host of the server have decided to get rid of the ice and fire mod. Holy crap! <laughs> what? What? Bro, I'm just trying to sleep! What am I doing? What is going on? Stop! Please! Stop! Stop! I just want to go to bed! I just want to go to bed! I just want to go to bed! I just want to go to bed. Please! Stop it! I don't even have a sword yet! And you're being mean to me! And I don't even have a spawn point yet! Wait, no, this is actually really bad. This is actually really bad. Wait, no. Wait, no, 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 no. Please. Please, just let me sleep. Just let me sleep. Just let me sleep. Please. I'm not asking much. Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. Where is he? Stay away. Keep away. Keep away from me. I don't want to see you. Die. Die. Yes. I killed him. Sometimes I hate those mobs. And I don't even really know what they do. I just hate them. They're just there. And I hate them for being there. You know? Okay. Jeez. That was certainly something. And I need to get some food. Luckily, and there's a little food bush right here. I can eat some of this. And then I think these are pears, which are ready to be harvested. What the hell are you? Stay away, stay away, stay away, stay away. Please stay away, please, 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 please stay away. What the heck are you? I don't want to stay near that thing. I really don't. I really do not. In fact, I think it's going to be safer on the treetops right now. So. Here I am. No clue what I am doing in the world. No idea, actually. Till I can upgrade my house. I'm going to have a really sad little hut. Just a hut. Hi there, mister. Doggy! Don't be mean to me, doggy. Don't be mean to me, doggy. Doggy. Can I kill you from here? Kill him! <laughs> no! Stop it! Stop it! Bad dog! Bad dog! Bad dog! Bad. Bad dog. He's running away, but he's gonna come back and I'm gonna kill him. Come on, bro. I literally just about killed you. Yes. Oh, shoot. World edits enabled. Well, I'm not gonna be using it, but. Whew. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, I need to get stone real quick. Oh, God. Because, um, what the hell is that thing? What is that thing? Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, 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 no. What are you? Hello? Hi there. <laughs> Rock. Hello. Sorry, I did not mean to be impolite, Mr. Rock. I was just wondering what you were. Okay, we need to get some stone because I can't use a wooden axe. Um...
nice old stone. And I actually feel like we should just go in here real quick. Maybe there'll be some iron. That's the ideal way anyway. Oh, there is. In pitch black, you were likely to be eaten by something. The sounds seem to have stopped for now. Okay, I'll take the hints and I won't go in there without some torches. Once I get some torches, I will help myself in there. Because I need that iron. I want to get started on some stuff. So the next uh, few bits are probably going to be me. I saw a time lapse of me mining in the mines and seeing how much I can get. So with that, let us begin the time lapse. Okay, everybody, I am back, and I actually got quite a bit of stuff, um, which is very good. I need to quickly make a chest, because, wow, that was certainly an adventure. Um, yeah, it actually was pretty fun. I still need to make... stuff too but let's just throw down the valuables 
I got a lot of um, stuff, and I'm going to use this analyzer. I'm going to put my analyzer right here, so that way I can start analyzing, and I am going to take some of this stuff, and I am going to start analyzing it, so yippee. Um, so there's some of that. Let's get some plant fossils in there. Now, apparently I can repair this. So if I search up sword, as you can see that happens. Um, I don't know exactly how to craft it. So you need an archaeology workbench. Um, I think, oh, a crafting table and paper. I can make that easily. Except I don't have any paper, so we're going to have to go out and look. But yeah. Um, I do also kind of want to start a little farm before I do anything else. And I also want a little hut. So that way I can be safe during the night times. Because right now I am very exposed in the night. I can sleep, but it's a bit hard to do. So... I'm going to cut down some of these trees and make a little simple hut around my base. That's going to be quite helpful. I also need a good source of food. Perhaps like a cow farm or something. I'm not quite sure what exactly to do. All I know is I want to make some type of farm. So... For now, let's just cut down some of the birch. It's gonna look a bit weird right now, but it'll look a lot better later on. So I got quite a bit of stuff. Uh, let's see here. I need to go over here real quick, because I am starving right now, and I need to eat some food, so let's break some of this. Eat some of this. You can also hear some zombies. And I don't want them taking stuff, so I'm gonna quickly eat up all of this. Grab a little bit more. I need to take these torches out of my offhand. I mined for quite a bit, and I kept running into this, uh, this monster. It's like this, um, stone monster, and it guards ores. It's quite annoying to, uh, fight, but I managed to find a strategy where if you have a block in front of you and a block on top of you, they can't attack you, and therefore you can just crit them out, and they won't be able to fight back. So I was doing that quite a bit, and I managed to kill everyone except one, which was the first one I ever faced. So I'm quite glad that I was able to get out of that predicament. Also, since I do have uh, exotic birds, I'm going to make an aviary and have a whole bunch of birds in there. It's probably going to be a giant building with like some wood and then probably some uh, glass over top. So that's going to be awesome. Right now, I'm going to quickly set up the posts for what I want the ridges or ends of my base to be. I'm going to have them be about four blocks tall and be up to back here, so we're gonna quickly take a piece of dirt. And I did hear that nymphs actually healed anything in their vicinity, but I'm quite healed, so I don't actually need that healing. Over here, I'm going to need quite a bit more dirt. It would be useful to have a shovel, but I don't right now. Which is okay for now, but I am definitely going to get one later on. But I think this has been actually a pretty good start. I might end the episode once I actually have a quite a situated base. But as of now... It's pretty good so far. Okay. Oh, uh, is that in the thing? No, it's not. Lucky. Okay, and I'm going to turn all these to planks and quickly build up a little house. And this will keep me safe from all of the monsters at night. 
I have been attacked by reapers a lot, which is not that fun. I also hope to find some sheep, so that way I can get an actual bed instead of sleeping in a tent. That would be a pretty good accomplishment. I don't really want to be sleeping in a tent, so... Also, I forgot to full screen. Whoopsies. Okay, I have full screen now. So... Just gotta finish this up. Let's see what this actually came out as. Oh, wow. We got... What is this? An Arthropolura? Yeah. Um, and then we got some junk. Kinda sucks. I also have my inventory completely full. We have amended stone tablets. Can you actually read this? No. Dude, I got a Reaper Claw! That's cool. I'll hold on to that. Mining away. I don't know what to mine. I'll mine this anyway. In this Minecraft is so beautiful. Mining away. What's that I found? Holy crap! No. No tree man. No. No tree man. No, no tree man. He's scary. I don't like him. I don't like the tree man. Ooh hoo hoo. Okay, I have a bunch of uh, stuff. Just pull this up. Bro, I literally spawned an ant. I did not mean to spawn him. I want to sincerely apologize to him, but I don't know how to sincerely apologize to a tree, so. Come here. Come on, I dare ya. Come on. Why can't I hit him? Holy crap, there's a second one. And I just broke my sword. Wait, no, it's not. It's right there. I must have dropped it or something. Guys, why can't I hit you? Did you guys break my house? Hey, mean! Mean! That's my house! Meanies? Now I gotta go kill these guys. Come here. You can't just be in my house. Get out. Get out of my house. Get out of my house. Dropping some major crits on this guy. Seriously, man. That was my house, you know. I bet they did know and they just didn't care. Okay, and that finishes my house. That's awesome. Now I can start getting rid of all this. There's so much birch towering. Okay, let's get some torches. Boy, some torches in the middle of these. There we go. One up there, one opposite of it. And maybe some. In front of these, I want one more torch. Well, this is gonna give me a lot more than one, but. So, with that being said, I think that is going to wrap up that episode. So, I hope you guys enjoyed, and with that, I will see you in the next one. Goodbye! Okay, everybody, I am back. So, um,. What? Who is Bob? Who is Bob? <laughs> oh, I'm so confused.